All right, coming up next, a UFC Bantamweight division fight. All right, so the fight is underway. We will see how it plays out. It's a pick em fight according to Las Vegas, and really hard to think of a weakness. Neither guys in their UFC careers. I feel like both of these guys do, Chase. They're the best of the best that we can put inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded. They have every skill. And that oh! He was hurt. Sorry. Oh, he might be out. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. So a nice instinctive, reactive takedown there shortly after he moves his opponent to the canvas. Now, now he's chasing the triangle. And this could be trouble here. Looks like it's pretty tight. He's trying to work his head out of harm's way. Oh, he postured up there. Now he's okay. Now he can escape. Oh, nice right hand. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw back to the fight. There's a song there, right? You know when to hold him, know, know when, when to hold, hold him. him. Yep, there absolutely. Oh, all right, he's got the full mount now, DC, and he has proven to be a hard guy to buck off from this position. Oh, because he's so heavy. He keeps his weight down. He really does grind on you with his, with his bottom half, his arm. His arms are free to punch. He's collecting you with his hips and his legs. Start to chase chokes. A lot of energy expenditure defensively if you are the bottom fighter in this equation. Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Oh, goes to the ankle pick now to get him down, DC. We'll see how he chooses to proceed from here. Got the ankle pick, flip from this position. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Cruz. He's throwing every part of himself into these big legs. Oh, nice job to stick with him. It's in there deep. There you go. Oh, nice. Somehow stays in the fight. He needs to build posture or just go to the next position. Start shoving that deep through, trying to get the half guard, which in turn will lead to more opportunities for advancement. All right, round two. Whoa! Massive head kick. Oh, nice high kick. Oh, counters with an overhand left. He's stuck. Here comes the separation now. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace. Ruse gets the double leg takedown. Just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Nice jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it. Busy doing great work. All right, single collar tie now. We're starting to see some of the damage cut underneath that. Big. Oh! He's a trouble. He's hurt bad. Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the thing land. Oh! oh! That was crazy! Oh, wow, that happened quickly as the fighter reverses position there on the ground. Unbelievable position change. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of trend. Third round underway. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really strong. Wow. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, he's hurt. You are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter. You're potentially playing with fire. Guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities, he passes the half. Oh, how about the speed on that reversal there? I mean, I know he's going to start looking to try to attack a rear naked choke, and that's exactly what he's doing. Because he's getting choked. The sheer will is... is DC. Well, this is some serious pressure from the top by Cruz. Oh, nice job to... Oh, bad. What a fantastic sweep. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done. He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's going to try to... Then he's out. Both fighters get up now. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are going to count. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh. 
Just missing on the high kick there. But, but nothing really in terms of combinations. To oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't That'll finish his do fight. It. Oh, my goodness. Exactly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. He's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Eve Levine has going to stop for this contest. At four minutes, 44 seconds of the third round, declaring the winner by knockout, Dominic the Dominator So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result.